It's I before E, except when your foreign neighbor Keith received eight counterfeit beige sleds from feisty caffeinated weightlifters. Weird! It's time for some suspiciously specific posts. Oh, can't forget these! Rest in peace, Eddie the sea otter that could dunk a basketball. And suck his own dick. <laughs> Screenshotting a meme on your phone while on the toilet, but it makes a loud camera click the same time your dad walks past the door? Now he thinks you're a failure and taking dick pics! So, does anyone else's family hide a tiny pickle ornament in the Christmas tree and whoever finds it gets to open the first present? Or am I a different kind of white? Yes! Hey, um... Sort of a side thing here, but if anyone sees an eagle drop a little brown chihuahua, let me know. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> Utah may make it illegal for cops to masturbate in their cars. Wait, what? The f happened here? And why is it may? Shouldn't that just be like public indecency? <laughs> I want to name my daughter Mayonnaise, and shorten it to May. May isn't short for anything, so no one will ever ask what her full name is, but she'll constantly <laughs> live with the knowledge that <laughs> that's... <laughs> Listen here, kid. You would be better off sandpapering a lion's ace in a pair of pork chop panties than being caught trespassing on this property, boy. Because what I'll do to that ace is far worse than what that lion would do. <laughs> I told my kids that the reason Santa doesn't like being seen is because in order to get down the chimney, he has to get naked and oil up. Huh. Update! My kids have abandoned all plans to stay up late and see Santa coming down the chimney. <laughs> I'm not like other girls, she said, golden skin shimmering in the summer sun. And she wasn't. She was a rotisserie chicken that I bought, took outside, and performed a small skit with in the parking lot before eating in my car while sobbing loudly. <laughs> 3 a.m. Me. I mean, why are any of us here? Really? Zoo security guard. I'm asking about you. Specifically. You're only a teenager once, guys. Ask your crush out. Go to parties. Make friends. Travel across Egypt wearing a trench coat with a classmate, a French guy, a fortune teller, your grandfather, and a dog. Yeah, the best way to be passive aggressive to a trophy store is to order a worst trophy shop trophy and um then never pick it up. Life. Reading Wikipedia out loud. Contrary to popular belief, the female black widow spider does not always murder and eat her mate. If she has recently been fed, the male is often allowed to live. Me. Me. Frantically boiling spaghetti water. R slash ask credit. You can change your gender at will. What will you do? I would switch to female, get pregnant, and have an abortion as many times as I can, and each time, save the fetus in a jar of formaldehyde and line the walls of a small room with them. Then, when I actually have a child and they act up, I would not yell, hit, or ground them. I would... <laughs> I would make them spend an hour in the fetus room. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Yeah, pepper spray is great till it leaks in your purse without you realizing it and you grab your chapstick out of your purse and then you rub your eye a little later and you blind yourself for a good 20 minutes during a busy Friday night rush at the restaurant you work at until you literally have the chef and dishwasher pouring milk in your eyes with the entire staff watching. Good times. In 2020, we stopped chasing people that don't make an effort to be in our lives. In 2020, we put ourselves first. In 2020, we do not try to domesticate a raccoon. But if one waters into our home because he thinks the couch is nice and he likes the atmosphere, then he can stay. Optable pet, Lola, likes 
sleeping in a sunbeam. Dislikes, 15th century feudal Japan. Please do not take Lola back in time to 15th century feudal Japan. She will not be happy. 16th century, okay. Obvious plant is pretty much my hero. I'm just gonna say that. I'm not gonna get too crazy tonight. Also, me. The outburst I had at Joanne's Fabrics is not reflective of who I am. Me, during sex. What's wrong? Her. <sighs> Nothing. Me, taking off the huge cowboy hat with neon lights that says Crab Ranch on it. N no, something's wrong. I can, I can tell. Four pictures of Jennifer Lawrence that'll make you say, That's not Jennifer Lawrence, that's a 2003 Puega 206! Wow, is that a 2003 Puega 206? He says it Puega? I'm a car guy, this fing hurts. Puega. Pronounce. Hell. Uh, how to pronounce Puget? Peugeot. Got it. Anyways, look at this Puega! You know, I have come to the conclusion that I'm going to get my nipples pierced, and then get each nipple jewelry with googly eyes on them, so it'll, it'll like I have eyes instead of nipples, and when it's time to diddle a dude, and he takes off my shirt, he'll be like, yo, what the f*** is that? And I could be like, <laughs> the, <laughs> the hills have eyes. Leave me alone. I was your Uber driver a month ago. R slash ask reddit. About how many full grown house cats would it take to pull a um, 178 pound man on a snow sled? And how would one get them all to go in a single direction? That sounds adorable as f r slash s credit uh, not, not safe for work um how has your relationship been with your girlfriend after she convinced you to put an egg up your ass sexually and calls you a yoke ass bitch even in front of your parents asking for a friend i don't want a job i just want to rotate slowly under a warm light like a 7-eleven hot dog my mom Where'd all my good jewelry go? Me, with 47 pounds of black tar heroin under my bed. Everyone's thinking it. I'm just saying it. Pirates. Uh, kidnapping a junkie off the streets, then uh, forcing him to play Skyrim for 72 hours straight. And when we do let him sleep, it's only for four hours until we wake him up by blasting the Skyrim theme music after injecting him with some heroin and telling him he's in the Skyrim universe over and over again. Until one day, he falls asleep. And we drop in and rule Scandinavia with a sword. Hey, you. You're finally awake. You ask me for the time and notice my watch is actually a live shrimp, hugging my wrist. He whispers, 12.30. But he's guesstimating, as shrimps usually do. Uh, you okay? Yeah, why? Well, I mean, I just watched you slip down a couple stairs, lay on the floor for a minute, and then start singing the baby shark song. So... Gotta ask. One dollar grilled cheese. No change given. Sort out your own shit. I don't have Venmo because I'm not some teenage asshole who vapes. Cash only. Danger! One dollar grilled cheese. Don't ask for a goddamn tomato slicer. I swear to God, I will reach through the window, pull you inside, and hold your head against the griddle, which will be embarrassing for you. <laughs> This side of the truck is not for customers. Do not approach. This window is here for me to thousand yard stare out of every time someone tells me they like my idea, but that I could make more money if I charge two dollars or three dollars. Yes, Carol, I know how money works. The window is aimed at a nearby meadow where a family of deer often gather. And one time I saw an owl, so I'm holding out hope I get to see the owl again when I'm ready to get back to selling you utilitarian eats at rock bottom prices for my own amusement. I will let you know. 
no. Do not ask me how long I will be. It'll just make me stare longer. If you would like to talk about Friday Night Lights, then okay. And no, I don't know where a bathroom is. Just took a DNA test, found out I'm 100%. Breaking down to the pressure of living up to the expectations of friends and family in a dystopian hellscape of late stage capitalism designed by the wealthy elite to keep me living paycheck to paycheck and eventually dying of a treatable illness. Local internet smart guy. You can kiss yourself in the mirror, but only on the lips. Well, I mean, yeah, Neil, anywhere else would be kind of creepy because I got more questions after that. <laughs> Uh, 50 million may not be by a small island to make the inhabitants worship me as a god while slowly replacing them with unicycling bears that know sign language. F you money. But it's definitely never have to work again and be able to pay someone to do my household chores for the rest of my life. F you money. Which is about all the f you I really feel like I need to give to the world. Me at Olive Garden at 11.02 a.m. staring down the elderly people, impatiently waiting outside knowing we should have opened two minutes ago. But my boss is in the back cheating on his wife with the girl who makes the salads, and he has the key to unlock the doors. I feel like a lot of people who have worked in the service industry or in fast food can relate to this, me included. Maybe not everyone, but a lot of people. This is actual advice the news is giving to southerners for driving in the snow. If you rarely drive on snow, just pretend you're taking your grandma to church. There's a platter of biscuits and two gallons of sweet tea and glass jars in the back seat. She's wearing a new dress and holding a crock pot full of gravy. Okay, so imagine finding out through Spotify that your partner has been cheating on you because the mother named one playlist, I miss your p Although you live together, and the one follower is the girl they told you not to worry about. If I've learned anything in 10 plus years on patrol, it's that every time someone tries to predict a crazy night, it really does get crazy. Full moon, Friday the 13th. Nothing. Third Tuesday in September at 4.03 a.m. though? Absolute sh show. Hey, folks, if you haven't noticed, it's still snowing outside. Like many of the beautiful things in life, it's also a little dangerous. KDOT is working to keep the roads clear, but if you don't have to be out, just, just stay home. Your superior snow driving skills won't negate the stupidity of the person that will hit you. Stay safe. I'm talking about you, 80s model truck with a lift kit and mud tires, blaring Van Halen and passing people like physics don't apply to you. See somebody on Twitter who is more successful than me. I gotta get off this website. Switches to Instagram. And see someone hotter than me. Man, this it. Goes on Facebook and sees a guy I went to middle school with is in jail for murder. There we go. Breaking down to the pressure of living up to the expectations of friends and family in a dystopian hellscape of the captain designed by the wealthy elite to keep me living paycheck to paycheck and eventually dying from a treatable illness! Ah, so close! <laughs> I was a four. Oh boy, the outro. I got two announcements real fast. First one, the important one. My buddy The Click, his channel was, uh, was actually just terminated out of nowhere by YouTube. So, if y'all could go to his Twitter and give him a little bit of love, that'd be fantastic. We're currently working on things. Second announcement, um, 500k. Once I hit that, I'll be doing a face reveal on my Twitter, so go follow me on Twitter. Yeah, do that. Anyways, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, subscribe, like, comment, do the YouTube stuff. You should know what to do because this isn't your first video. If it is, then hey, welcome to YouTube. Kind of a really weird way to be introduced to the system, huh? Anyways, uh, yeah, I'll see y'all next time.